Hello everyone, myself Antari from Zorhat Medical College. Today we are going to discuss all the important MCQs from page number 15, chapter 2 biological classification from class 11 biology. Now starting with dinoflagellates, the very first important MCQ can be from their habitat that is marine and photosynthetic. The next important MCQ from this page, I think uh, from dinoflagellates is uh, the most of them have two flagella and one lies longitudinally and other lies transversely in a furrow between the wall plate. Uh, from each word of this sentence can be an uh, MCQ like one lies longitudinally, other lies transversely in a furrow in between the wall plates. So you have to be very very clear about this uh, sentence. The next MCQ from dinoflagellates can be about the red dinoflagellates which has been asked many times. Red dinoflagellates are goniolacs. This has been asked many times and this red dinoflagellates due to their rapid multiplication make the C appear red. This MCQ has also been asked many times. Uh, now uh, coming to the euglenoids, euglenoids very first MCQ can be they, they belong to fresh water and stagnant water. About this habitat uh, it has been asked many times and do not get confused between other classes and in the euglenoids. Now uh, one more important MCQ and which has been asked many times is about the cell wall of the euglenoids that is euglenoids instead of a cell wall they do not have a cell wall but they have a protein rich layer protein rich you have to remember this and protein rich layer called pellicle pellicle you have to remember it has been asked many times which make the body flexible the function of the pellicle has been asked also. Now another MCQ about a unique feature of euglenoids is that uh, though they are photosynthetic in presence of sunlight when they, uh, in presence of sunlight they are photosynthetic but when deprived of sunlight they become heterotrophs this, this is an uh, important mcq because it is an unique feature now another mcq from in euglenoids can be about the pigments as they are same as those of the higher plants this mcq has been asked also in previous neat uc examination that which uh, in kingdom protista which uh, organisms have uh, pigments uh, equivalent to higher plants that is uh, euclenoids uh, now coming to the sl uh, slime molds uh, they are the saprophytic prote protist do not get confused ever that Saprophytic protists are only slime molds. It has been mentioned in the NCERT and asked many times. The body moves along decaying twigs and leaves, engulfing organic material. This line also constitutes an MCQ about their movement. Now, plasmodium has been asked many times, and you have to remember it anyhow that plasmodium uh, they form under suitable conditions slime molds, but uh, they form an aggregation called plasmodium, which may grow and spread over several feet. This MCQ has been asked many times and during favorable unfavorable conditions plasmodium differentiates and forms fruiting bodies. This MCQ has also been asked that which uh, forms fruiting bodies. Uh, now these pores are uh, dispersed by air currents. Now you have to also remember one thing that plasmodium uh, which uh, they form fruiting bodies these are extremely resistant. Now coming to the protos ones pro about their they, about their about their um, food style that is heterotrophs and they are the predator parasites. This MCQ has been asked many times that which of which in the kingdom protista are uh, predators. That protos ones are the predator parasites. You have to be very very clear. Now coming to the major groups of protos ones. First group the as as amoeboid protos one. And they live in fresh water, sea water, and moist soil. You have to remember their habitat. Other groups of protozoans will be discussed in our next video in uh, page number 16. Meanwhile, one more important MCQ from this page is uh, this um, image based MCQ can be framed uh, to match column A with column B, or they will give you a picture and you have to identify that uh, organism. So you have to be very, very clear about this uh, picture based question. Thank you.